Alrighty, what a YouTube. My name is Serials the Dude here on YouTube. I'm here with LGU's Maturity Commentary Challenge. Now, I'm just gonna wing it because that's what I do best. So let's start. Um, right now, I have a web page open. It's on dictionary.reference.com, and we're gonna look at the definition of maturity. Here we can see that the uh, first definition is the state of being mature, ripeness. Do I consider myself ripe? Well, I'm maybe a little bit chubby here and there. So I guess so. Full development, perfect or perfected condition. Maturity of judgment, to bring a plan to maturity. Full development, mm, 19, I don't know when mills fully develop, they say what, 25? The brain finally fully develops. If you're talking about, you know, other parts of the body, we already got that down. Perfected condition, I am nowhere near a perfected condition. I, maturity of judgment. I guess this is the one that I guess everyone's been going on about maturity of judgment can you or how do you approach a situation how do you handle a situation this is where the maturity of judgment comes in and let me tell you what it is not bad to be immature on this YouTube site okay um, do you understand that some people put up the most immature videos yet people still watch their videos do you understand what I'm saying um, in the YouTube community, there is no limitation on, I guess, how immature you can be. Or there is no level of maturity that you must have. Which is awesome because it allows for a variety of people, different commentators, different personalities to show up in the sub box. If I like watching, I guess, less mature videos, like say, I consider El Presidor's videos to be less mature, but I find it very entertaining. Just seeing him do what he does, cry about the little things in the game, knocking over a tree. He's just a beast, right? Then you got people on the other end of the spectrum, um, per se, like originally when I used to watch C Nanners. His videos were pretty mature for the time. I was in high school. I thought he was pretty mature. I watched his videos. So when it comes to choosing the videos you watch on YouTube, I believe you have to, I guess, judge people. There's no other way around it. You cannot lie and you can't deny it. People judge other people all the time. Okay, you do it on an everyday basis. Maybe you don't realize it, but you do. For example, like say you see some guy down the other side of the street with his pants sagging down. You already have formed an opinion just by looking at him without even talking to him. People do it all the time and it's not bad. We're human. It's okay to judge people. When it comes to this YouTube maturity thing, you judge the different, I guess, personalities, different people on how they handle themselves on the camera, on the mic, all right? You see how they react to different things that happen, um, say, within the community. You see how they talk or hear how they talk, whatever. And you see how they handle themselves with different people. So I believe you form an opinion and then you start watching their videos based on your preference. So if you are an immature person and you do like watching immature videos, you're going to tend to watch immature people. Same thing if you're mature and you want to watch mature people, you tend to watch the mature people. It's that easy. And that's how I believe maturity ties into this YouTube community. You start judging people based on your preference, based on your maturity preference. You start watching their videos because of your maturity preference. And it's also okay if you consider yourself to be a mature person and watch immature videos. I do it all the time. I consider myself mature and I still watch immature videos because they're entertaining. They have some value to me. There's some videos you watch have some value to you, no matter what kind of video it is. It's kind of like you have a tolerance for a certain level of maturity or a certain level of immaturity. That's how I believe this, I guess, maturity concept ties in with the YouTube community. You form these opinions on people and some people form it based on maturity. And I guess what I'm trying to get to here is that maturity is just one of those items that you use to judge people on, whether it be in real life or on this YouTube community website you tend to prefer people who are kind of like you. So, I guess that's the end of my video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. It's kind of short, which I kind of wanted. I didn't want some long ass video, but yeah. Thank you guys for watching. My name is Sir Was A Dude here on YouTube, and thank you LGU for accepting this video. Peace.